Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if the Java installer has failed error you might be getting on your Windows computer. So this should hopefully be a fairly straightforward tutorial and without further ado, let's jump right into it. So we're going to start by opening up a link I'm going to have in the description of the video that should take us to a Java web page here. Depending on what your operating system is, you might want to select either the Windows or the Macintosh version. For the Windows version, I would recommend downloading the Windows Online version because these other two are going to be the 32 and the 64-bit versions. And the issue is even if you know what version of Windows you're running, different web browsers might use 32-bit versions of their browsers on 64-bit computers. So that you'd actually have to download both. So I'd recommend just downloading the first option here. But if you want to download either one of the local full installers, you're welcome to do that as well. So once it's done downloading, you just want to open it up. It's going to ask you want to allow us to make changes to your device. Make sure it says Verified Publisher Oracle. You want to make sure it's getting it directly from Java. Then you want to left click on yes. It's going to say welcome to Java. Left click on install here. This will take a couple moments to run, so just be patient. Okay, so if you did it successfully, it should say you have installed Java. You'll be prompted when Java updates are available. Click on close, and that's pretty much it. At this point, I would recommend you guys restart your computer. And that should be about it for this tutorial. So I do hope I was able to help you out. And as always, thank you for watching, and I look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.